All right, so moving into it, Inkling, Gandor, Firmanubis, and I Nice. What is this winner semis? Uh, yeah, this is winner semifinals. Yeah, winner semis, Ganon versus Inkling. On paper, probably a really bad matchup for Ganon, but you know, <laughs> Gandor needs to touch it three times. Yeah, literally three hits. That's like fifty percent. <laughs> And then you're at kill percent. I bet you see how Vermanubis deals with the speed here. Because as, as strong as uh, Gandorf is, you know, all I analogy needs to do is just wait for those little moments of lag as he's coming down from the aerials and sneak in there. Reading the landings, yeah, for mm -hmm. sure. And staying right outside of that range of a uh, side being down here. Yeah. Because those are really good burst options. And they can deal a lot of damage just like yeah. everything else he does. Yeah, and the kill is going to be either from edge guarding or roller. Because roller obviously buries them, keeps them down pretty easy. Can pick the turn. Nice up airs, keeping Ganondorf up in the air. Probably a, a lot of his aerials are pretty slow, except for like Nair and like. See, right now, okay. Ganondorf could probably kill. One more hit, and the Ganondorf increases the kill percent. Ooh, up air. I throw up air. Take ooh. Out. Ooh, nice. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, oh, a spot to kick. Let's go. Oh, oh tried, to, tried to jump, but analogy too fast. That was a good ledge jump. That was fast. Yeah. I, that was a say? good attempt. Oh. Yeah, right there. Inkling's a little special state that they go into when they dash. That allows them to low profile. Yeah. Ducking under Gandorf's nares there. So that's going to be that's gonna be hard for Vermanubis if he's trying to space the nares. Because, mm -hmm. you know, nares just a great tool throughout neutral. Because they run into it. Oh, hey, that's, that's good damage. Yeah, and I mean... Oh. Mm. I feel like that was maybe a little... Nice side tilt. Killing mid-stage at around 150. Let's go. Yeah. The analogy did not make it easy. Yeah. Ooh. Trying to read the tech option with a spot roll. Yeah. Good stuff. Ooh. I wonder Ooh. if that was intentional. I've heard of people deliberately missing text just so they can't get hit by a splat roller. Yeah. So um, I mean, there's, I do it all the time just to mix up my getups. Yeah, or just but like, you don't stuff. always want it. You don't okay. always want to tech or get up attack. You know, you've got options. Do anything to throw off their rhythm and time. Mm -hmm. Oh, we got combos. Got oh, up there, oh. up there. Oh. I thought that was gonna be another another. Yeah, this is good. This is looking rough here. Another platform. Ooh, goes for the side beat. Unfortunately, doesn't get it. Ooh, that is the second time he's punished that uh, forward smash with roller. Oh, there you go. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Beautiful edge guard. Good edge guard. Yeah, that, I'd say Inkling definitely one of the best edge guarders just because of how deep you can go and how strong yeah. all of this character's aerials yeah. are. It's not necessarily that her hits are strong, like except for like back air, uh -huh. but that they last a long time. Well, I think forward air is stronger than back air. Yeah. Yeah. So but because it's used so often in combos and That's just true. neutral in general, it's generally going to be weaker with edge guard. Mm -hmm. But like a lot of fair air, forward airs, good ones, they last a long time. Yeah, they linger. So you can just like, it's not just one space. It's like, all right, I'm going to hit this. And then as I drag it down, this space is right. mine to guard. Um, going Smashville as a counter pick. Um, yeah, keep it tight. Not as much spaces and platform there allows uh, forward smash and up smash coverage for Ganon. Mm -hmm. And I mean, maybe having a big platform in the middle might be able to, you know, give him somewhere to go if he's getting juggled. Because it seems like Ganon doesn't really have that many good landing options. You know, a lot of his landing options have a lot of lag, so right. you can just, you know, wait for it and react. You can usually get a punish. So maybe this could be a good place to go to, or not. <laughs> Um, yeah, Gandor, yeah, Gandor definitely wants to try to trap any any of his opponents that he plays. Inkling pretty much benefits from every platform though with those ladder combos. You know, up air, oh, up air, up air. That grab out of the, <laughs> the start up of the roller. Mm. Snatching mm. him right out of there. Yeah. Board that was, and this is also a smaller stage too, so Gandor doesn't have to chase uh, Inkling around that off that much. Ooh, roller again. The forward smash. Taking uh, the first stock, but he's playing at 81, so we could yeah. see the stock disappear fast. Ooh, that could have been close. Ooh. Sets neutral, good stuff. I've seen a lot of people uh, not necessarily snap the ledge, but let that last little hit at the end of Ganondorf uh, up B just uh, graze yeah. him. Yeah, they're holding down, down as they're coming up so they don't get the auto snap. Mm -hmm. And it's like. 
just a good get off me thing. Like yeah, if someone's right. waiting on the ledge, it pretty much forces them to shield or get hit, you know? Ooh, we might be looking at a two stock here. Another yep. roller to smash. Oh, man. That, I was wrong, it's not two stock come. Don't listen to me. <laughs> Old man Messiah Freak doesn't know what he's seeing anymore. Uh -oh. I need new glasses. <laughs> new prescriptions. <laughs> Ooh, nice job. Uh Driving him out of that side beat. Not looking super uh, good for Ganon, but you can still do this. Yeah, I mean, there's still. We never count Ganon now because he just hits so hard. Things are looking a little rough. Yeah, his eye analogy is not letting Verm breathe at all. Yeah. Whatsoever. Ooh, he's just. Oh! See, now. Ah, see, now. I want, you know, what I want to see more from Inklings is like, when you, you've got the hit confirm after you do the roller, right? Ooh, good tech. Ooh! Oh. Oh. So after you hit the roller, just literally jump and air dodge backwards, mm -hmm. and you'll land right on top of it. Yeah. So at those high percents, you don't have to worry about ever missing, especially when you get them near the ledge. Mm -hmm. So, you know, 